Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you the 5 best courses on computer programming. So I've already made one video like this back in 2020 about the top 5 courses for computer programming and that video was very well received. So again I've done some research and I've got for you the latest and the best courses on computer programming in 2021. And all of these links will be given in the description box. From there you can check the courses out and buy them if you want. Okay, so the first up on my list we have Graph Theory Algorithms for Computer Programming 2021. So as you may know, graph theory is a very essential part of computer programming and almost in every computer programming contest, there's one or two graph problem in which you have to do either BFS, DFS or use any graph algorithm. And this course covers everything about graph theory. This course is created by Pratik Narang, Apar Kamal and Pratik Narang is a very famous computer programmer from India. You can just Google his name and see the results. And both of them, Pratik Narang and Apar Kamal, are very high-rated coders from India. So you can trust anything that they're saying. And this course, like I said, covers everything. The graph basics, the applications, PFS, DFS, any graph algorithm like Dijkstra, Bellman, Floyd Warshall, topological ordering, and everything. Apart from that, there's 80 plus competitive coding questions and the solutions are given to that as well. And this complete code repository in C++ and Java, doesn't matter which language you're using. So this course basically and this course is something I can vouch for because I've taken this course before and I know Pratik Narang and Apar Kamal. So once you take this course, you'll be able to understand any graph algorithm and you'll become a master of graph theory. So after taking this course, whenever you see a graph problem in a coding contest, you'll be able to solve it in little to no time. Okay, next up we have the Bible of Coding Interviews and Computative Programming created by Romeo Fantastic and I already covered this course back in 2020 but this course is so great that I'm covering it again. Okay, so Romeo Fantastic or Andrei Chiriak is a YouTuber who has a YouTube channel Algopedia where he used to upload YouTube, uh, where he used to upload code sources solutions and this guy's thought process is just amazing. If you just look at him explaining a problem, you'll gain a lot of knowledge from that itself. Also his videos are very very motivational as well. So this guy's thought process is in and, on, in and on itself something that you can learn a lot from. After taking this course, you'll get a really strong foundation of computer programming, algorithms and data structures and not only that, it's going to help you ace your coding interviews as well. So basically it's a win-win. Next up, we have Master the Art of Dynamic Programming created by Ajay Prakash. Okay. So dynamic programming is again very essential in computer programming. In every major contest like ICPC or IOI, there's at least one problem on dynamic programming. And dynamic programming is considered to be something very difficult to understand. But this course creator Ajay Prakash has broken down dynamic programming and he explains to you the step-by-step -step approach to solve any dynamic programming problem. He has given detailed solutions with code in Java and Python to over 15 popular dynamic programming questions. So it is a little bit language specific, but the thought process is something that you can learn a lot from. So he has given step-by-step -step solution and he has explained recursion, backtracking, DS and algorithms about dynamic programming. So once you take this course, whenever you see a dynamic programming question in any contest, it will just click inside you and you'll be able to understand the problem and solve it. So again, this is this course is something that you should take if you want to get good in dynamic programming or if you want to excel at computer programming on higher levels. Okay. Now, next up we have Game Theory Algorithms in Computer Programming. So this is a very, very new course. Again, this is created by Apar Kamal and about him you can uh, read also. So he's a master on code forces. You can see that he's a master on code forces and he's six stars on code shift. So he is a high rated coder. Okay. And graph theory is again used at easier problem, easy medium problems in computer programming and this guy covers everything in graph theory in this course. So you'll learn in-depth game theory game theory concepts, you'll learn problems which are easy, medium and hard so he'll be explaining those problems to you and after taking this course, after looking at his explanation, after seeing the theory concepts, you'll be able to understand game theory and whenever you see a question like that in a contest, you'll be able to understand it very well and solve it. Okay. Next up, we have Mastering Critical Skills in Data Structures using C++. So this is one of the highest rated courses. You can see that it has a 5 star rating with 176 rating and 996 students. And this is again a recent course, a new course. And this course is created by Dr. Mustafa Saad Ibrahim, who is very popular on code forces. So Dr. Mustafa had a sheet for newbies on code forces. And with that sheet, a lot of newbie 
coders have gotten high rating. So Dr. Mustafa has helped a lot of newbie students, newbie computer programmers gain extremely high rating. So he's very popular on code forces. And after you take this course, you'll become a master of C++ because he has explained critical skills. He has explained advanced data structures. He has done them, implemented them in C++. So once you take, take this course, once you look at his videos, you'll be able to understand how the data structures are working. And not only that, like I said, you'll become a master of C++. So you should take this course if you want to learn coding in C++. You learn if you want to learn computer programming C++ because it is a little language specific. But if you're going forward in C++, then you should absolutely take this course. Because this course covers everything that there is about data structures. And you'll become a master of data structures in C++. And like I said, Dr. Mustafa is again someone I can vouch for. He's very popular in code forces. You can just Google his name with code forces and you'll, you can see the results. So that's it for this video. These are the five courses, which the best five courses, which I could, which I could found for computer programming. All of these links are given in the description from there. Just check the courses out and buy the one which suits you best. And that's all guys. Thank you.